Hi, you guys. This is Prophetess Afil Sabrina Acapo. I am back again with another prophetic word via the leading of the Holy Spirit. And as with any prophetic word, you will absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the Spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. And Holy Spirit, I invite you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. I decrease as you increase. Allow me to bring forth your word with your glory, with your power, with your grace, with your mercy, telling your story so your name can be glorified for the win of the souls to the gospel of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's mighty name that I do pray. Amen, 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 amen. So you guys, I was actually looking at a scripture this morning. And I had forgotten all about it. But when I ran across it, I definitely knew I had to bring it forth because the rhyme of words are just out of sight and out of mind. And the title of this prophetic word is going to be Bursting Forth. Bursting Forth. And I'm going to start off with the scripture of Genesis 7, 11 through 12 in the 600th year. Of Noah, of Noah's life, on the seventeenth day, on the seventeenth day of the second month, on that day, all the springs of the great deep burst forth, and the flood gates of heaven were opened, and the rain fell on the earth for forty days and forty nights. So, this is the second month. And on the 17th day, that's what the Lord spoke to me when I was laying in bed this morning. I was like, wow, this is really a powerful revelation and a powerful frame of word. And the Lord is saying, there is about to be an abundance of rain in your life. Your life is about to take a drastic turn around Everything is working out in your favor that the heavens have opened. And this is the month of your open heaven and it being an abundance of rain that is bursting forth in your life as never before. There is an open door. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. This is that second month and on that 17th day, the Lord is wanting you to be in expectation because he is doing something new. You are walking in your wealthy place. This is a birthing forth as well as a bursting forth new season of his grace and his glory and new mercies on your life. And those new drastic changes are taking place in your life and your, ne your life will never be the same. And it's starting right now in this second month of February. I just wanted to give someone that message because the Lord definitely wanted me to release it and to let you know that increase is here and increase is here in this month of February. And definitely let that scripture permeate, absorb, flow, and saturate in your spirit because I am telling you, God is doing something new and it's going to be in abundance to the full, to the overflows, exceedingly abundantly above all that we could ever ask or think. Ephesians 3 and 20, according to the power that is at work on the inside of us. He is saying you are bursting forth into a totally, completely new dimension. You have swam through those proverbial waters and you have gone through those deep waters and the Lord is saying you have came out with a drastic change that's going to change the entire trajectory of your life and even change your name. And the Lord is saying he's doing it this month. This month, February the 17th in particular of what this scripture is saying. And the Lord is wanting me to read it again just so you can get the revelation and the understanding of what he is saying in this word. And as well as with those rhema words. And Genesis 17, 11 through 12. So meditate on this once you get a chance. In the 600th year of Noah's life, on the 17th day of the second month, on that day, all the springs of the great deep burst forth and the floodgates of heaven were opened and the rain fell on the earth 40 days and 40 nights. Don't you know if the Lord did it for Noah? With all things new, 
for him and his family because he favored him. The Lord is saying favor is on your life and there's an open heaven and there's the rain that's bursting forth on your life. The same thing he did for Noah when he made all things new because Noah had favor with him. Same way you have favor with him. He is changing the entire trajectory of your life. Your new birth is bursting forth. And your new life is bursting forth. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And don't forget to hit that notify bell where you guys can be notified each time I upload a video. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that this word has definitely absorbed in your spirit. And you were able to get that quickening in your spirit. You were able to get that revelation. And I'm telling you, we are walking into our wealthy place. That time has burst forth. This is the month of our time to shine as pure gold with such an enlightenment, with such an excitement, because the heavens are open and the Lord has favored us. And this is our time to receive the release. This is our time to receive manifestation and fruition of all the Lord has promised, purpose, and predestined for us. It is a new time. Arise and shine for your light has come and the glory of the Lord has risen upon us and that old things have passed away. His words said, behold, I'm doing a new thing. It shall spring forth. It is bursting forth. It is birthing forth. Now as pure gold, the same thing he did for Noah, he is doing it for you. The heavens are open. There is a spring of water. There is plethora of water that is bursting forth in abundance of rain that is changing your life to where your life will never be the same. And this is that time in that season that your life is breaking for and that your life is bursting for forevermore. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And until the next, may the Lord richly bless each and every one of you guys and see each and every one of you guys through to the greatness of success. I love you guys, and I am constantly praying for you. Take care. And until the next, we'll talk soon. God bless you. Bye-bye.